Here's part two of how to use ChatGPT to plan the itinerary for any vacation on any budget in less time than it takes me to make this video. ChatGPT gave me five great ideas and I went with Palm Springs, California. It's itinerary time. Here again, to get what you want, the best thing you can do is be specific. ChatGPT already knows that it's acting as my travel agent because of my earlier prompt. I tell it I want to stay seven days and six nights, and I have a budget of $3,500 for two people. I tell it I want to experience the food scene, mostly on the lower end of prices, but with one night out that's really special. I ask it to include the itinerary, some opportunities to experience the culture and the great nature in the area, as well as to bake in some time to relax. Finally, I give it a rough range of what my hotel budget is, and I tell it in my budget I've already taken care of the plane tickets. Wham Bam Alakazam, a seven-day itinerary full of things that I would love to do in Palm Springs multiple suggestions for hotels and budget, and a reassurance that it all fits within 3,500. I verified it does. The best thing about ChatGPT is you can keep playing with it. So I responded and said, hey, can you make this like a $1,000 budget instead? And it cranked that out. Mostly the change was just in the recommended hotel. It also recommended more or less expensive activities and dining options. Small caveat here, ChatGPT is only indexed through 2021. So if one of these restaurants closed or if the rates changed at the hotel, can't really control that. Still, I think this is a great jumping off board to get you excited about your vacation, ready to start booking things, and ready to have a general idea of what you're gonna do when you get there. This is just one example of how I use ChatGPT to make my life easier. Follow along for more.